Okay, uh, welcome Mrs. Wright, thank you for coming. Thank you. Um, how would you describe the focus of your work and why do you think it's important for the industry? Well, I have this wonderful privilege of serving as First Lady of Iceland, but I have always had an interest in travel and tourism and sustainability. I have a background in travel journalism. And so when I began serving in this role as well, I thought it was really important to be able to talk about this this vital sector which is actually the biggest contributor to Iceland's GDP is the travel and tourism sector and because I was born and raised in Canada in a different country I feel like I, I also kind of see Iceland with an outsider's eyes even though I have lived there for for many many years now so it's one of the things that I enjoy doing is coming and, and speaking at these events and really showcasing the diversity of what it is that we have to offer uh, from Iceland as, as a tourist destination. And what are the key messages you want to convey at the ITV convention? What are the insights you want the audience to take home? Gosh, I mean, there's a lot of different things. One, of course, is that Iceland is open for business and we're excited to take on new messages. But uh, this year at ITB, for the first time, we are all, we have two stands. We have the regular sort of travel and tourism stand and also travel and tech stand. So we have new companies here that are working in the tourism industry, providing tech solutions to tourism providers. That's something that's really exciting for us. And always the opportunity to meet with people from Iceland and, and to get to know our people and culture as well, because that's something we're really proud of is, is our open culture, our gender equality, uh, how welcoming we are to visitors and, and the positive experiences that visitors have to our country. So that's something that we hope to give you a bit of a, a taster of here at ITB. ITB Convention's motto is pioneer the transition in travel and tourism together. What's the main challenge of this transition and how can we tackle it? I mean, that's a big word, isn't it? Transition. There's always change going on. There's constantly change in the travel and tourism industry. And I know recently and in many years, we've been talking about sustainability of the environment. Uh, when I think about transition sometimes now, I also think about these tech areas and, and moving, um, f you know, using AI, for example. And I think that there's actually a lot of potential when it comes to that in the travel and tourism industry. At the end of the day, it's always about people and it's about the stories that we're sharing and the interactions we're having with each other. But I think that technology has a real opportunity to help facilitate that, to really uh, smooth things out, to make things faster and more efficient so that, that those human interactions that we're having can really uh, focus on just the, the positive sides of things. And I think that's some of what we are showcasing here at ITB through our travel and tech solutions are exactly these solutions that are helping people to, to streamline, to be more efficient and to allow themselves to spend more time with their end customers. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you.